Hey guys and welcome back to a new video on this channel. I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So today I will teach you guys how you can tell for any WordPress website or at least for almost any WordPress website which plugin and which theme does it use using a simple method by checking its source code. So let me jump straight into this. I will be checking some big or at least uh, interesting WordPress sites. One of them is Bloomberg.com. Another one is Yoast.com, the Yoast CEO plugin site, TechCrunch, and also WeepInitiate.com. This is one of my websites. So let us jump straight into this and start with Bloomberg.com. So for this, let's right click on the page. I'm using Chrome for this but you can use any modern browser they will have this functionality and search for view page source click this and the bloomberg uh, html source code will load up and here uh, search by uh, hitting ctrl f on your keyboard and enter teams slash this is the folder where WordPress use, where WordPress stores its uh, theme info. So this will list the themes and also plugins that the website might use. So if you search for plugins, you will see similar results. So you will see that this website uses Bloomberg Favicon and this is seems to be a plugin that they built bloomberg form builder bloomberg cookie consent so they created custom plugins by for themselves by some developers probably and bloomberg webinars they are filled with custom plugins so they don't seem to use plugins that are available publicly now let's go to yoast do the same uh, stuff so note that if you click on an image you will not see the view page source you will have to click on a white um, uh, layer of the site now let's search for the same so we will see that Yoast uses WooCommerce Duracell Tommy Google Tag Manager this is an interesting plugin and if we search more they use the ceo plugin that they built this is not so surprising also the video ceo plugin is active here or at least i'm not sure in this case they might advertise the plugins with this name so yeah in the yoast uh, plot websites case this is a bit might be a bit confusing but let's go over to TechCrunch view page source and they use here a VP Parsley plugin with an interesting name and if we search for themes we see that they have a custom team built for themselves back in 2017 so TechCrunch 2017 is the name of their team so this is not available on the market for sure so yeah this is the method how you can search for plugins and themes using the view source uh, of any website and besides of this let me give you some bonus tips so for example on Yoast website besides of this method you can also check comments because developers usually add comments to the source of uh, the websites so they generate some custom code in the plugins and they also add some comments so people might recognize the plugin especially if it's a free one and th they will be able to spread the word about the plugin using this method so on the yo site we will see that a uh, developer added a comment here so this site has installed PayPal for WooCommerce version and the URL of the plugin and also other comments like this site is optimized 
with the Yo CEO premium plugin. So yeah, this is the next method. Also, a uh, last method that I want to show you is simply using search to search through the website code. So for example, for TechCrunch, um, if we search for CEO, then we might find some interesting stuff because the website seems to have uh, heavy metadata on CEO description title, but uh, yeah, this takes up some digging and some research on uh, what website, what plugin and team does have active. So if it is not so intuitive and you do similar keyword searches, then you also might have to use Google. So you can search Yoast all in one plus CEO plugin. So yeah, they don't seem to have active these uh, popular plugins. They might have built for themselves a custom plugin for this. So yeah. The basic idea is searching source code for the Teams and Plugins folder of WordPress, searching comments, and searching the plugin name or some uh, HTML classes and ideas that you know that the plugin that you are searching for generates. So this applies only if you are searching for a specific plugin in a website code then you know that it generates a class, I don't know, Yoast uh, something, and you can search for that code in the HTML of the website. So yeah, this is how you detect plugins and webs and uh, themes on almost any WordPress website using this simple method by checking its source code. If you enjoyed this video and if you uh, found it helpful, please subscribe to this channel. It is really appreciated. I release a new video each day at 7 p.m. GMT. Thank you for watching until then. Until next time, have a nice day. Stay safe. Bye-bye.